BBEX North America 2016 is going to be held in Minnesota, and it's a, it's kind of a rare setup. We are uh, it's a cooperative effort between Minnesota, Minneapolis, St. Paul, Bloomington, where Mall of America is located, and Mall of America. It's five entities working together to uh, bring uh, all of the North American travel writers and travel bloggers to uh, see a part of the country that a whole lot of people don't get to see, but a quickly rising destination nonetheless. So tell me, what what can the world's travel bloggers, North America's travel bloggers, expect to see and do when they get to TBEX North America 2016? Uh, well, that's the thing about it. The selection, the variety is going to be uh, outstanding. And that's, again, because uh, all five different entities working together. Uh, technically, while well, all of the conferences being held at Mall of America and uh, the neighboring Radisson Blue Hotel, during and after the conference, we're going to have pre-BEX tours and post tours in the Twin Cities area, meeting Minneapolis and St. Paul and uh, Bloomington, and also in the wider outstate Minnesota. Uh, Minnesota is uh, an extremely green, and when I say green, I'm talking physically green, literally green destination. The city of Minneapolis, for example, uh, no one in the city lives more than six blocks from a park. And uh, we have one of the only national scenic byways in the United States that's located entirely within an urban area. 2016 is the 100th anniversary of the uh, National Park Service in the United States, and Minnesota has quite a few uh, outstanding parks, uh, particularly up north, the Boundary Waters Canoe Area, and uh, a lot of the uh, parks that border with Canada. So tell me, a lot of people now watching this will be going, hang on, Mall of America, T-Bex? Yeah. Tell me about the relationship between something like you know, travel bloggers exchange TBEX and Mall of America. Does it sound like maybe it'd be a tough sell to get a bunch of travel bloggers to hang out at a mall? No. Uh, actually, yeah, it, I think it will be, and um, that's uh, that's going to be part of the fun, kind of uh, exposing them to uh, what Mall of America is. It's uh, it's a lot more than just a, a place to go shopping, which you know that is primarily the thing. We have no tax on clothing and shoes uh, in the state of Minnesota. That's a huge attraction, but why we are still relevant in this day and age when malls are collapsing everywhere is we are a, a destination. We have the largest indoor theme park in the United States, the longest indoor zip line in North America, the tallest ropes course in the world. We have a 1.3 million gallon aquarium with saltwater fish, freshwater fish. You can go scuba diving in that aquarium. Uh, we have 520 stores, just in case you want to go shopping while you're there. And a lot of their experiential tours. There's cooking classes. You get a behind the scenes tour at the aquarium. You can see how they keep the fish healthy, how they feed them. And then, yeah, if you uh, want to shell out a little bit extra money, you can go scuba diving or uh, snorkeling in there. We're going to be using the traditional TBEX North America hashtag and TBEX hashtag in general, just hashtag TBEX. TBEX will be uh, disseminating that information as it becomes available.